Hello and good day. Thank you for joining this Green Blue Urban training clip. Today we're going to talk about irrigation and aeration. Now both of these are very critical for life. We all need oxygen and we need water. When we think about planting trees we are often more concerned about water than about air. But trees like us need air as much as we need water if not more. So it's critical that the soil around our tree pit is kept aerated. Green Blue Urban innovated these perforated watering systems, irrigation systems, nearly 30 years ago now to help to decrease our mortality rates from newly planted trees. It's very simple based. It's based on a perforated pipe which we um, supply in diameters of 35 mil and 60 mil which we wrap around the root ball. These should be just around the shoulder of the root ball up to about a third of the way down the root ball. We're trying to irrigate this tree in such a way that the water percolates down through that fibrous rooting area to actually give us the water where we need it. Now this perforated pipe which runs level around the root ball actually it means that you have 360 degrees of watering all around that root ball. It's important it's level. We're not looking for a helix spiral to give the water a, a roller coaster ride around down the root ball. We're looking for this even percolation. Now we cut the pipe to the required length before we fit the T-piece on and the chosen inlet. Now the pipe con um, connecting the inlet should be cut down to suit the planting depth. It shouldn't be wild and waggling out of the ground. It should be just above the level of mulch or surrounding vegetation. For this installation, we're using a root rain urban, which comes with an open grid top to stop the debris clogging the system, which is covered by a self-adhesive cap, which has to be removed before planting. There is a sticker on the side which shows us the desired depth that it should be installed to. We also offer the Urban with a hand spun aluminium lid known as the Civic. This gives a better class of finish for a higher quality installation. <clears throat> this can be used in hard and soft surfaces. We often get asked for situations where uh, an automatic irrigation system needs to be linked into the green blue urban root rain systems. This is often on podium decks um, or areas where the, not a lot of natural precipitation will actually occur. This is very simple. There is an adapter which fits into the downpipe and the inlet um, between the inlet and the actual root rain circular pipe loop. The auto irrigation can be fitted and installed to a number of different irrigation systems um, fitting the Toro and Rainbird just for two. For areas where we're having hard paving, we do a range of premium metal cast inlets that are decided to be integrated into hard paving. Here we have an Arbovent 100, which is square in design and fits perfectly in with many paving schemes. Here we have a precinct, which is the same principle and but circular in design, simple to install and can be core drilled into a solid stone paving. We are aware that often debris gets uh, swept down into these inlets when they're at pavement level. So Green Blue Urban supply an inline filter which also helps atomize the droplets of water coming through these inlets so that it reduces any erosion in the soil below. The, the filter hook is very simple, um, simple design. We remove the filter, the irrigation lid, and we then just draw out the um, atomizer filter, clean it out and put it back in. This method of using irrigation and aeration is very important. Of course, these are all aeration inputs as they're only irrigation ones when the water's going in. The rest of the time they're helping keep the soil healthy, aerated, and as we do look after the soil, the soil looks after the tree for years, decades, and probably centuries to come. Thank you for watching.